What's up guys? My name is Ilyas and welcome to the 26 tutorial on jQuery and in this tutorial we are going to create the same function we created for the for the switch right we'll create switch left so that we can go to the previous uh, pictures and um, you know we already learned a lot about jQuery and built this nice jQuery portfolio and I'm sure you already are able to create um, more interesting things using your knowledge right now. So, but now let's just go ahead and do the same feature for the left uh, click function. And um, I won't copy the code, I will just uh, write it uh, again. So, we uh, create um, a variable called previous or previous list item and set it equal to the current li dot prev. And what that prev is is the same as the dot next, but it just gets the previous element in the list. And then we can define the prev source as well, and uh, set it equal to uh, prev list item dot children, and grab the image element out of it and get access to its source attribute, where the path to the image is stored. And then um, we uh, select the main picture, the main image, and set it source attribute to this previous source, which we just fetched it right now. Yep, so, and then don't forget to reset the current, L current list item to the brief list item. So now it's, it's done, and now you can scroll from the right to the left, like, like so. But there is a problem, and if we reach the end of the list, so this is the last picture, and we we click right, and there's uh, nothing happens, and we, when we click left, nothing happens as well. So everything gets messed up when we get to the edge of the list. And now we will um, we will fix this bug, and there is a nice workaround I just figured out. So every time we uh, set up this next li thing, we will check if the if the next or if the current element is the last one. And if it's the last one, we will instead of selecting the next element, we will select the first element. And it's actually very easy to understand. All right, so let's check if uh, the current li is uh, last child, which is just dot is. So jQuery is actually a wonderful thing I mean it's so intuitive so in order to check if it's the last child you just say uh, the element dot is which is a function and you just say last child so if it's the last child we will run this code and if it's not the last child we will run something else so if it's not the last child we can uh, grab this line of code and paste it here so we can access to the next element and if it is the last child we can just go ahead and say next li should be equal to the to the hmm let me figure out real quick to the portfolio li dot first and this should work out let's just check so I'm clicking the last image and I want to click to the right and it did so we just uh, jumped from the very last picture to the first one and if we continue uh, clicking next we will go all the pictures um, all the pictures um, in a circle so uh, now we did it and well of course it's very easy to do the same functionality for the left click so we can actually copy this code snippet and paste it right here and I'll just get this line of code which gets the previous element and I replace it like like so and instead of saying next li of course I need the previous list, list item and instead of saying first I can say last and here, instead of saying last, I can just say first. And let's just go ahead and test. I click the first image, and I want to go back. Hold on, I, and I want to go back, and it goes back. So now we can uh, 
scroll the images to the right and to the left. Is it wonderful? And you know, it's only uh, well, it's not that many lines of code in jQuery because you have all these cool selectors, and you can ask if the element is first child or not for, or not first child just using this is function. So this is something really cool we learned in these two tutorials. And I hope you guys had fun, and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial where where we are going to uh, learn uh, lots of cool stuff. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the 27th tutorial.